What's going on guys, it's your boy DragonLZ back with a new video and I'm and today I'm gonna be reviewing the Dragon Stars base Vegeta by Bandai. Now um this is an amazing thing. This is a very good figure to start off with. And so uh, yeah, let's uh, let me take your side and now uh, look at the box. And uh the box I um, I have to say I'm like I'm really um, impressed with the box. As you can see, you have the uh, Dragon Stars logo. You have the name Vegeta right there. As you can see, it's an open window with the Shinron accessory right there. Um, as you can see, it's an open window with, with a very cool effect uh, in there. If you open it up, actually, you can um, see the effect. It looks really nice in uh, the box. Uh, so as you can see, like it comes in like a uh, cardboard box type thing with a little final flash effect right there. It looks really nice. So uh, yeah, it looks uh, really nice. Um, um, as to uh, other things in the box, you got the uh, Dragon Ball Super logo right there. Um, you know, age four, four plus, everything. Um, on the side, you got a picture of Vegeta right there. There you go, that's Vegeta. And on the other side is just the open window for the box. And on the back is just uh, show you the figures in the first wave. As you see, you get you have Goku, you have Vegeta, and Beerus. And as you can see, you, you have a uh, Builder figure, Shenron right here, which you can get all the pieces if you buy both waves. Um, personally, me, I'm not gonna buy um, like all these. I'm just gonna get the Vegeta. I already have them, so um, I'm not gonna get anything else. Uh, so uh, yeah, uh, looks like I won't be completing any Shenrons. So uh, yeah, uh, that's enough of the box. Let's now do uh, the figure. So here he is. This is Prince Vegeta in the flesh right here. So um, yes. All right. So uh, the sculpt. This figure has an amazing um, sculpt. I think I think everything looks nice. Uh, the uh, the armor looks really nice. I think it looks nice. Uh, the hands they look amazing. Um, the boots. Look really nice. I like how uh, I have like the line details in there. Um, the everything else looks nice too. Uh, the, uh, the hair, I love the hair on this figure. Um, the face, it looks really nice. I like the way it's called the Vegeta. It, um, it really looks like him too. Um, so yeah. So for articulation, the head goes around 360. Uh, there's no there's no up and down movement. Well, there is, but it's very slight. So there is up and down movement, goes up that much and down that much. Uh, side to side, there is side to side. It's um very good too. Okay, so um the arms it goes up about that that much. But if you want it to twist it around, you can also get some more added articulation. Uh, uh, bicep swivel like that. Oh sorry, bicep swivel like that. Uh, the elbows um are uh, are um double jointed so you can go the first joint you go to about right there and the second joint goes to about right there uh the wrist uh, they're on standard um ball peg they um uh, they go back go about that far and forward about that far um 360 at the wrist so as you can see like that um uh the waist uh you do not get that much of a of, of a um, diaphragm joint but but there is one there it's like very slight so um yeah uh for the hips we have a drop down feature i just like the bandai machinations as a figure arts it goes down about that much and uh legs they go up about mm, about that high they go back about that far and uh pull it up knees are also double jointed they go about that far um, uh, the boots do not um, rotate. That doesn't really bother me because I mean, I mean if you wanted to rotate the boots, I mean uh, You'd obviously be rotating the feet. So I mean if the feet are already able to rotate Then I don't think there's a problem if you can't like rotate the, uh, the boots. So uh, the boots um, Now they go 360 and they go up and down. That's really good too. They go up and down like that and you have a twist at the ankle like that. So yeah um uh, uh overall it's a really good figure and i really like it um 
As for the uh, accessories, it comes with two um, open palm hands like that. As for Final Flash or Gallic Gun or whatever open blast or open hand pose you want to do, it goes like that. Um, uh, the Shenron that was with him. Uh, let me get that out right now. It also looks really amazing. Uh, the sculpt on it, it looks really nice. I like the way they painted it. It looks just like Shenron. Well, the, I guess the body part of him. So, oh uh, yeah. I mean Shenron. <laughs> okay, now, um, as for some size comparisons, uh, here I have uh, the SS Figure Arts, um, Broly. Um, yeah, uh, it, it is, um, definitely a scale with your figure arts, as you can see, it's uh, in scale with Broly here, and I also have the SH Figure Arts Goku right here. He is, uh, he is taller than the SH Figure Arts, um, Vegeta, but he's still shorter than the Goku, as you can see right there. So, uh, yeah, that's all the size comparisons I have. Well, I know, I'll do one more. Let's do a size comparison with Golden Freezer right here, with uh, which at the moment has as um, no tail because it's in my bucket and I don't feel like getting it. So, um, yeah, to Frieza, really, really big um, size difference there, and um, and from the reviews I saw on the figure, I haven't seen anybody try to like swap heads with the figure arts Vegeta, so I'm gonna do that now. I'm gonna get my. Um, Super Saiyan Vegeta head and swap it. Oh my gosh. I apologize for that, guys. I am sorry. <clears throat> Crap, hold on. Okay, guys, I am back. Um, I apologize for the wait, but but here I am with the uh, figure right here. I have the head right here. Let's uh, switch it up. Um, it takes a bit of force, uh, but you have to twist and pull. And there it is. Uh, just a just a standard ball peg for the neck. Um, as for the Vegeta, just pop the head on. Um, it doesn't really like like fit all that well but if you have some uh sticky tack like i do you can just make a stick on there and to be honest this looks really nice i really like um uh this look it looks like a super saiyan a super vegeta from when he fought on um, cell you know so yeah this looks really nice i'm actually gonna um set him up in final flash pose real quick let me do that real quick for you guys just to give something like to end this video off with a nice final flash effect for you guys my amazing viewers we're almost at 2,000 subscribers thank you guys so much oh my gosh you can probably tell my voice but I'm super hyped right now to, um, to be this close to my goal 2,000 subscribers oh my gosh it's not that much but come on it's a lot for me so as you can see we got the final flash pose right here it's about to happen final flash or um and uh 